for nine years. The beer makers and bar backs at Panther Island Brewing have waited patiently. There's risk reward to everything. Business is good, though they're betting it will boom in time. Once we see them breaking ground uh, on that and actually making this an actual island, It'll be very, very exciting. Ryan McCorder and company selected this space with future development in mind. They'll be among the first to tap new foot traffic when this peninsula becomes an island with a sort of river walk. This week, the Tarrant County Water District signaled its intention to commit $116 million toward that vision in 2024. What we're doing is making way for the core to be able to start construction. Matt Oliver so, says right now, fun. workers are relocating pipes, utility lines, even buildings from space that will eventually be in the canal. They're almost done, he says, meaning the Army Corps of Engineers could begin digging the channel as early as next year. Every aspect of this project, every partner agency, what they're doing with, everyone is moving full speed ahead. That includes developers. An Austin realtor known for its high rises and mixed use venues purchased nearly 30 acres of land on Panther Island this week. The sound of uh, jackhammers and things going up is the sound of progress and that just makes us so happy. It's momentum, a long time brewing. In Fort Worth, I'm Matt Houston.